Uh, I think actually the most expensive, the, the most valuable item that we have in this year's auction is a Stormtrooper helmet from Star Wars A New Hope. So that has an auction estimate of 120 to 180,000 pounds. It's again incredibly rare. It's one that actually matches a particular scene in the film where Leia is flanked by uh, a couple of stormtroopers when she's been confronted by Darth Vader. So it's scene specific. We know it's that helmet from that scene as well. For two or three hundred pounds, you could maybe acquire a script or some call cool sheets, maybe a crew jacket or garment, or maybe a lesser prop, something that's maybe more in the background rather than seen in close up. Uh, we have some great newspapers from the Batman films, and in fact, a couple of newspapers from Back to the Future as well. And those are things that are seen in, in frame, in, in shot, but maybe just a little bit off in the, in the distance. And those you'll pick up for a few hundred pounds. Things they use in the first film as they move on just become out of date and they won't need them? No, no, no. Just in case they go. Sure, well, we've got, uh, we've got hoverboards from Back to the Future. We've got Michael Keaton's bat suit from Tim Burton's 1989 Batman. We've also got Jack Nicholson's Joker costume as well. If you really want it, we've got a five-foot Tyrannosaurus Rex skull from the most recent Jurassic Park film. We've got fully remote-controlled droids from Star Wars, really, you name it. And even going back to vintage Doctor Who, we've got blasters from vintage Doctor Who as well, and even K9's head. So there, there is something for everybody here uh, across, uh, I think, in total, over 300 films and television shows.